Kirkland Center police are using a new creative method to catch distracted drivers who are texting behind the wheel. Reporter Sonia Goins shows us what they're doing. We've seen people veer off on the shoulder. We've seen people blow a stop sign, blow a red light. Although it's against the law, many motorists will get behind the wheel and either reply or send text messages. And not realizing how dangerous being distracted behind the wheel is. Do you know why I'm stopping you today? Today, Brooklyn Center Police are kicking off a new campaign called Dump the Distracted Driving. Here's how it works. One officer rides along in a dump truck as a spotter, watching drivers as they pass by. 3-7, we got texting. She then relays a vehicle description to another officer stationed farther down the street. It's going to be the one just approaching uh, DuPont. Hi, copy 3-7. What's the vehicle description again? Officer Hussein then pulls that vehicle over. Can I take a look at your phone, just make sure that you're not texting or anything? Brooklyn Center Police say the dump truck blends in with normal traffic. People have been surprised. They ask, well, why are we pulling you over? The big truck also gives officers a bird's eye view of what's happening on the roads. When we drive a regular squad car, there's only so much that we can see because a lot of people have been having their phones closer to the center council. Or... With school about to let out for the summer and more folks hitting out on the roads, Brooklyn Center Police want to remind folks to put down their phones and pay attention. I've personally pulled over 15 people. In Brooklyn Center, Sonia Goins, CCX News. On August 1st, the Minnesota hands-free cell phone law goes into effect. Brooklyn Center police say the law will make it easier to crack down on distracted drivers.